Hello YouTubers and hello world, this is Alex signing in here at EOS Marketplace News. So for today I will be giving you an update about your favorite currency, cryptocurrency, your favorite token or coin. So um, this news is brought to us by PCN or Preferred Currency News. So guys for more videos and updates, please, please, rather, please hit that subscribe button here in our page or here in our channel so that you can be updated in all our videos okay so stay tuned now um today's news heta chain blockchain platform for the smart economy so this is brought to us by preferred currency news if you want to check the news yourself you can visit pcn.today all right now Blockchain as a technology needs a supportive ecosystem of legal boundaries and deep economic integration to solve modern society issues. Former CEO of the Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum Foundation enters the quest to connect blockchain with businesses and local governments determined to bring decentralized economy to mass adoption. Now, high-tech silos versus everyday users. As the world becomes increasingly connected, advanced technologies like LOT and electric governments are being massively employed to improve all aspects of modern life. Now, the problem is, too often people fall into the fallacy of thinking that technologies alone can transform how people think and go about their lives without actively addressing fundamental issues that comes with advanced technology yes it's sad but it's true right now privacy concerns digitalization requires the acquisition of sensitive data but the data collected are usually not reported transparently to the people authorities as well as corporates have been known to exploit this information without public approval sensory overload if you want data you need sensors which require compatible infrastructures to install and massive amount of energy to function steadily next interoperability interoperability right there is no universal standard for smart systems and lot or lot devices each device is an isolated silo unable to communicate or share data with anything outside its own system okay now the blockchain revolution world leaders are starting to embrace blockchain as a cross protocol solution that shares decentralized database between very different services tracks and encrypts data securely provides seamless transactions and offers credible transparency for public services UAE is now pushing to turn Dubai into the first blockchain city by 2020. We hope so. UAE authorities plan to create a paperless digital government. Wow, paperless, so we can save a lot of trees, guys. Removing the paperwork burden on both citizens and government officers. So it will make our works easier, right? Or their works easier now however most blockchain platforms also come with their own set of limitations first network speed as of late 2016 cryptocurrencies with the largest capitals and trading volumes per day like bitcoin can only process about seven transactions per second ethereum 25 per second in comparison, Visa can process 24,000 transactions per second. Wow. Okay, privacy. The openness, decentralized, and immutability of blockchain pose a problem under the new European General Data Protection Regulation, or what we call GDPR for short. Now, changing too fast for regulations. When basic regulations were finally in place for cryptocurrencies, 
blockchain has moved on to a far wider range of applications than payments. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, right now, this year, 2018, the law regarding blockchain is still a gray area, making it difficult for new users to approach the technology. All right. Now, let's move further. further. The whole is greater than the sum of its parts. Clearly, blockchain by itself doesn't produce magic, right? The following requirements are identified for it to reach widespread adoption. Let's see. First, availability. The blockchain platform must be widely available and easily acquirable, tradable, in both tangible and intangible forms, such, um, such as goods, services, legal enforcements, and etc. Second, irreplaceable. It should be replaceable, guys. The technology must enable people to solve problems by utilizing as few resources as possible. As a result, those problems can't be solved nearly as well or efficiently otherwise. Next, confid um, confidentiality and authenticity. Unauthorized access to resources and sensitive information is persecutably, um, persecutable by law. Of course, right? That's very important. Next, transparency, integrity, and accountability. Resources and information on the blockchain platforms must be immutably and transparently recorded on a decentralized distributed ledger, making it impossible to deny transmission or reception of a source by all parties involved, right? So we can we can now sense what's the what will be the pros and cons, right? So let's just hope for the better. Okay, now Hitachi smart economy solutions. Dubai ranks first in the world when it comes to sheer number and size of blockchain platforms being adopted into real life usage. Among projects, ambitious to lead transformative movement is Realm Investments project Hitachi. Mr. Sultan, this one, he, him rather, Mr. Sultan Ali Rashid Luta, the chairman and CEO of Hitachi. Founded by Sultan Ali Rashid Luta, former CEO of the Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum Foundation, Relam Investment is he um, headquartered in Dubai, UAE, with other group offices located in India, Vietnam, Egypt, Turkey, and United Kingdom. Sultan Ali Lutza was the main person responsible for the 2005 upgrading of Dubai Department of Economic Development's IT infrastructure. In September 2018, last September, Relum Invested officially launched Hitachain or Hitachain and its ICO aiming to become the technology backbone of smart economy systems around the world. Started in Dubai, the project will proceed to London and Turkey throughout this year, 2018. Designed to be a universal blockchain platform for diverse industries adaptation, Heta Chain or Heta Chain is a D Post plus BFT hybrid network focused on addressing the blockchain scalability problem so as to enable cross industry scale transactions. The project strives to provide solutions to help tech services break down the adoption wall between them and the public. Okay, bridge protocol. Through this protocol, data is still securely enclosed while the private chain communicates with the main chain to update abstracted transaction details to the public ledger. Next, DApp Store. Plug and play DApps, software, smart contracts, etc., pre built by the community and third parties for the ecosystem. Off chain database, designed for large data storage. Hedachain's main chain connects with third-party data centers to provide enterprises with big data analysis 
for efficient project development. And lastly, auto-generating DAP. The platform allows anyone with little programming knowledge to create simple smart contracts by just dragging, dropping, and adjusting. Wow, Hitachain uses blockchain's decentralized and encrypted properties as a way to store, save, and optimize resources. It acts as hub for connecting companies with modern data technologies and in-depth insights that helps to significantly shorten decision-making time. So true to the vision of the project, HetaChain does not develop its system alone. It is working very closely with technical partners and advisors like Mr. Ali Juma um, Alajme. Correct me if I'm wrong, all right? Director of UAE's Ministry of Health and Prevention's IT Department, MLG Blockchain Solutions, and Stallion um, I to deploy its mainnet and other applied blockchain um, platform functions. Now, ecosystem expansion and market liquid uh, liquidity development. Business model is the core of Heta Chain's strength. Now, since launching, the project has focused much of its efforts into expanding its ecosystem so as to ensure and increase the market liquidity for Hetacoin. Now, thanks to partnerships with leaders in financial investment and public management services, Hitachain is able to provide entrepreneurs and organizations instant connection with the business founders and investors in a wide variety of markets through its smart, um, through its smart economy platform. Last September 2018, this year, Sultan Ali Luta and Michael Gore, the CEO of MLG Blockchain and advisor to the Kerala Blockchain Academy in India, have met and discussed possibilities of cooperation with Shafi Parambal, a member of 14th Kerala Legislative Assembly, Indian National Congress, and represents Palakad um, constituency, Mr. Parambil will be the main supporter of Hitachain in India to apply blockchain to government and India's own smart economy system. So guys, as you notice, we are getting bigger and bigger. So um, there's a lot of users now. So we hope that you will be one of us right because our um our community is getting bigger and bigger all right in my understanding as quoted okay in my understanding kerala can take pole position in global blockchain environment and both michael and sultan has agreed to work very closely in helping us being at the forefront of this innovation I will actively take this topic in legislative assembly as well as in other forums to ensure that we develop a landmark policy for blockchain technology. It will also provide new markets for our farmers and help us develop into a global hub for innovation. Mr. Preamble, that's his post and his official Facebook page, guys. Now, starting from May 2018, Relam Investment has entered the Indian market with a commitment to invest $300 million in real estate and technology sectors over the next five years. So, guys, blockchain platform for the smart economy. Now, last also since May 2018, Relam has um, officially cooperated with the IAC company to launch T-Hop, a system of online cargo and freight in, um, freight in Egypt that runs on Heta chain. Last October, oh no, this month, October 2018, Relam officially signed a memorandum of understanding with Mr. Zhang Yu Xing, director of Fuzhou, Fuzhou High Tech Industry Park. Guys, I'm really sorry if I read or if I read the 
of words incorrectly so if you'd like to comment on the comment box you can correct me all right so forgive me if i'm wrong now director of fuzhou high-tech industry park to implement hita chain and t hub at fuzhou high-tech Part. The MOU or MO will empower Hitachain and T-Hub to serve various sectors in China, such um, such as tourism, banking, healthcare, e-commerce, and other industries. Now, Relem has also partnered up with the Cygnus Technology Services to launch technology system in UAE and Vietnam. Thanks to the financial strength and experience of Relam and the support of Vitachain, um, a support of high profile partners rather around the world, Hitachin is able to systemat um, systematically achieve its roadmap goals much more reliably than pure tech projects that um, that are trying to mobilize capital through ICO campaigns. As a result, Hitachi's ICO goal is mainly to expand and diversify its network of users, thereby increasing the scopes and possible markets of its partner, projects within its smart e um, eco economy ecosystem. Currently, Hitachi is preparing to launch its public ICO campaign from November 11, 2018 through the end of <coughs> February 10, 2019. So for detailed information, just please visit the site, okay? Now, onward to a global scale smart blockchain economy, if done right, smart economies backed by decentralized platforms can enable individuals to report their unmet needs to a collective database and become actively involved in the process that will help balance and optimize global resources amidst the feverish race between governments startups and global tech giants towards a new blockchain utopia a project that closely connects countries at the government and local business level like Hitachain might just be able to take the torch and march forth through this still unfolding revolutionary era of big um, distributed data and hyper connectedness. Whew, that's tough. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, guys. Okay, excuse me. So that's it for today's news. So, guys, if you want to have more updates and news every day so that you will be the first one to get notified, visit preferredcurrency.news and subscribe now okay so you so if you will be one of our subscriber you will have a lot of advantages and if you are doing still um if you are still doing your research then we can help you with that by subscribing to preferred currency dot news i will share to you what's the advantages okay now first i will um I will be telling you how much is it it's only fifteen dollars per month fiat okay you can use your PayPal for monthly recurring that's <coughs> fifteen dollars per month only fifteen dollars or you can also use coinbase the coinbase option that's only 180 dollars annual subscription that's to be paid with your favorite crypto just imagine right so it's 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 really a good investment for me because um preferred currency dot news really helped me be updated and it's really a pleasure for me to share the information with you guys really honestly so um just visiting the website guys you can see a uh, um videos here so if you click one of these uh, videos right here it will take you to the right channel on youtube okay and you can see or you can find more videos um so don't forget to hit that like button and then subscribe to our channel here on youtube all right now also you can contact us directly just type your name here your email and then your message and just hit send and uh, if you like, you can save the contact details of Donald Lewis or Donald the Guru 
um, you can call him if you were uh, um, call USA here his number is available here if you're using WhatsApp then here he is also in WhatsApp his Skype ID Twitter you can follow him at Twitter at preferred crypto because guys he always posts some updates okay he posts some updates and news every day and you can tell a telegram channel telegram PM to Donald Lewis at preferred crypto alright so what are you waiting for subscribe now just easy just click this link guys and you can subscribe and by subscribing you can have um, you can have this newsletter every day like this newsletter so with this newsletter we will be sending it through or via email now you can see the articles and news on the first part now when you read the whole part of the newsletters you can see the the blue letters here the blue words that those are the links okay you can also open those links in order for you to be updated um, for example EOS marketplace.news you can add your listings PCN.today like our news for today right now marketplace.pcn.today to place your additional listings preferred currency news if you wish to become a web subscriber right now pro um to get started you can sign up at procoinbase.com to change if you want to to change some US dollars into Bitcoin so that you can then transfer that Bitcoin to the Binance exchange as shown here below you can change your Bitcoin into EOS if you wish to right so that's your choice now here is a good place to advertise whatever you have for sale or for rent in exchange for EOS tokens right so you have a lot in just one website you have a lot of other websites that you can visit right so all is in here especially the Donald's research list so guys when you um, open the Donald's research list then you can be updated Mm, you can be updated with the crypto I mean with the tokens or coins status okay for example as you can see here in the first um, column you can see the names of the tokens or coins now for example you invested uh, let's see let's have the best news when we say best news it is colored like this one blue so let's see let's find for example let's talk about EOS okay now for EOS um, October 28 2018 EOS USD recent price is 5.39 now share of total market volume that's 4.71 percent Google searches compared to the past seven days that will be 92 percent 50 candle SMA movement that's crossing up 50 and number of positive technical indicators that's zero 24 hours current volume versus price that's 109.24 and then the last seven days are weekly volume versus price that's already 6.98 and etc right so um, the status of your favorite token or coin is already here in just one spreadsheet so if you will be um, subscribing to preferred currency news then you will have the um, the pleasure of having that information very accessible to you right very convenient so what are you waiting for subscribe now okay so guys that's it for today but before I leave I just want to um, give you a reminder that we here at EOS Marketplace News we are not financial advisors so we highly recommend that you do your uh, or you make your own research about the tokens and the coins that we already mentioned in our videos or that we will be mentioning in our videos and then you can decide for yourself afterwards right 
okay so guys thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe okay this is alex once again signing off bye